to Kuala Besut in Malaysia. We stayed overnight here before heading over to the Corinthian Islands today. We're getting picked up at about half 11 from our hotel to go down to the jetty to head over to the island. I'm very excited about it. We're just nipping over to the supermarket just to buy some bits of fruit and I don't know, just some stuff really to take over to the island. We're camping on the island, which will be pretty cool. I've lost Stephen. Oh, he's there, he's found a cat. <laughs> I wondered where you were. Oh. Oh. Yeah, we're camping on the island. When I was looking at uh, prices for the island, it was quite expensive. And then I found this one on Airbnb. Uh, Rainforest, Rainforest Beach Camping. It's like 11 pound a night, so we're gonna give it a go. It should be good. Done the shopping, got a bit of fruit and some uh, cereals and stuff to take over. I'm gonna go and pack up now and head over to the jetty. We're all packed up. Check this out. I've just been looking. Thunderstorms, 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 thunderstorms. Yeah, thunderstorms the whole time we're there. Okay, we're off. Our lift, I know, our lift has arrived at the jetty. When you get to the pier, you have to pay like a, a government tax to go on the island, a bit like on PP Island in Thailand. It was 30 for adults and 15 for children up to age 12. That's for non-Malaysians for Malaysians. It's only five for adults and two for child. We're getting on. We'll be careful. What? Rock the boat. <laughs> Using looking back, gotta laugh for gotta live. Cause I'm so over the past, and I'm living it fast. We have arrived. Right, we're going to sort out, checking in. The water is very nice, isn't it? That way. Crocodile Rock Villas. That way. That way, orangutan camp. It's through there. That way we're going. Yeah. Look how clear. This water is, it is absolutely beautiful. Isn't it gorgeous? The boat's going to take the other people around to other places. We need to go and dump our bags and then I'm getting that water. Four. Okay, hopefully it's not a long trek through this jungle to get to the campsite. Oh my God, I'm shattered already with these bags. Wow, look at the water though. So beautiful. We're definitely going to need our mozzie spray in this place. Oh no, we've got to go up here. Oh crap, this is not good. Okay, hopefully it's not too far up there. I have to put everything down and use two hands. It really is a little jungle trek. There is no way I can go up there with all these bags. So I'm going to do it in a couple of trips, I think. Yep. I'm sure there's no one's going to steal our bags. Maybe I should have bought that bag with the passports. Here's the campsite. I'm just going to stick our bags in. We're a second tent up. This is so cool. Showers, toilets there. There's a washing machine. It's mad. Oh. Here's our home for the next couple of nights. A little tent in the forest. It's cool, isn't it? You like it? 
and the toilets are down there, like I said. There is a ton of mosquitoes though, so we're gonna get changed and head to the beach. We're going back down, I'm absolutely boiling. Going back down to the beach to jump in that sea, oh my goodness. I was just talking to the guy then that was up in like, he called it the office, it's not an office, but you know what I mean. Um, he was saying that like Mirror Beach, it's just like five minutes walk the other direction. Oh, there's a lizard there, look. Oh, it's gone. I see it. See it. Um, see yeah, five minutes walk in the other direction. He said that's absolutely beautiful, but we just want the closest beach. You just snapped a twig. Just, did I? The closest beach just to go in the sea for now. We'll explore Mirror Beach. I mean, maybe later, because it's only, I don't know what time it is, one o'clock, something like that. Maybe later we'll go to Mirror Beach when we're a bit cooler. Whoa. Whoa. Did so I catch him on camera? So glad they scared us. So am I, they best not come in our tent. Down the steps here, that way is Mirror Beach. And this way, Stephen's running. This way is, um, oh my goodness, there's like mozzies all over me. I'm getting eaten alive. Um, yeah, this one is Rainforest Beach. Our little beach here. Stephen's ready. <laughs> He's jumping right into it. Whew. The water is so warm. Is it nice? It's so clear and so beautiful, isn't it? That's nice. The great yellow sun is reflecting in your deep blue eyes The day has begun You spin around, you spin around, you laugh to yourself And I see you shine in every color, resting your head in my arms You sing la 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 Such a nice little dip in the water, it's so so beautiful. Unfortunately, Stephen is not feeling too good, he's just been to the toilet and been sick, and he's gone back again now. I'm not sure why. Hopefully, he'll be alright. Maybe he just needs. Maybe. I don't know. I think he's I guess he's full of a cold and everything. Maybe he's like just been swallowing his snot and stuff. That's nice, isn't it? Stephen's back, he's feeling a bit better now. Poor thing, he was sick again. We're leaving Rainforest Beach, we're just going to have a little walk through the jungle over to Mirror Beach. The guy said, I don't know, I don't know whether there's like more stuff over there or no clue, but we're just going to have a little wander. We were just looking then, there's a little like cafe area with like snorkeling trips, like water taxis. So if we didn't want to walk through the jungle, you can get like a water taxi there to different beaches, different parts of the island, so that's pretty good. This is a much easier jungle walk, isn't it? Does walking make you feel sick or? Are you alright? Your belly's sore? Oh. Yeah. Look at this lizard. On our little walk. He's huge. Mirror Beach wasn't far at all. It was really like a five minute. You know when someone says it's a five minute walk but you don't believe them, do you think, yeah, yeah, I bet it's about ten. <laughs> it's really not. It was dead close. These are for rent, these nice bungalows. We haven't got enough money for those. <laughs> Although they would be nice, they're a nice little hammock. We like our tent though. Aww. How pretty is this? It's just kind of like Rainforest Beach to be honest, but just a little bit bigger. Clear blue water, white sand, it's gorgeous. Although, unfortunately, <laughs> The tropical paradise island doesn't really go with being sick, does it? Change of plan, he really isn't feeling so good, so we're going to go back up to the campsite. It's just not where you want to be when you're feeling like crap, is it? Camping with, like, okay, well, yeah, we've got toilets, but you know, like, it's not, not a nice, comfy toilet, and you just want to, like, be on a nice, comfy bed and relax, but 
There is hammocks down there. You can relax in a hammock, but people are in them. That would have been nice. Yeah, he just wants to... Uh, you want to go to sleep? Oh, poor little thing. Yeah, we're going to go back up to the campsite. We're back up in the tent. This one's going to have just a little rest, I think. And I don't know, just see how he feels in a little bit. What a shame that he feels like crap. I don't really know what the deal is, why he's kind of feeling like that. I've given him some water and like one of those fluid replacement drinks because he's obviously, if he's been sick loads, then, and it's so warm, like he's sweating loads, he's lost a lot of fluid. So he's got one of them and he's just relaxing. I'm going to go and see if there's a free hammock and go and do some editing or I may just chill out here in the tent to be honest. It's quite nice. I like it. Like, look at the view. Nice when I lie down. This is the view that I'm going to see in the morning. Pretty nice. I think though I can actually hear thunder. I may be wrong, but I think there might be a thunderstorm brewing. That'll be crazy if the rain comes down anything like I did yesterday. If you didn't see yesterday's vlog watch it the rain came down crazy last night if that happens here in this tent wow i'm scared <laughs> there's a squirrel out there can you see it i'm just doing some editing i think he's gone to sleep poor little thing i feel so sorry for him hopefully he'll feel better when he has a sleep Drink something, have something to eat. Oh, there's another little squirrel. I think he's a squirrel. See it on that tree there. Stephen's had his little sleep. He's feeling much better, aren't you? Yeah. He's feeling much better now. So we're gonna wander down and get something to eat we weren't going to bother we were just going to stay up because we bought some little bits like fruit and bits from the uh from the mainland so we weren't going to bother but i think we'll probably get hungry if we uh yeah i've got the torch with me it's like six o'clock now so by the time we come back up it will be dark so i've got a little torch i don't know like we don't really know kind of where there is to eat or whatever but we think there's somewhere Possibly just down there on Rainforest Beach. Stephen saw before there was like um, when he was being sick, he went to the toilet. He saw that there was um, somewhere to eat. Most of the places to eat are over up north a bit on the island. Uh, I think it's called Coral Coral Beach, and then on the other side of the island is Long Beach. That's kind of like the touristy part of the island, from what I can gather. Oh, how nice is it? I'm so glad to be back by the beach. I love being by the beach. That's the place we're going to there. That's where we're going. Rainforest Cafe. We've changed our mind. We've left that place. <laughs> we're continuing on. We have a feeling that there's somewhere along here. Book your table in advance. We might not be able to. We found this place, Crocodile Rocks. But it says, open from 6.30 till 10. Book your table in advance. We'll go and see if they have any tables or anything. We got a table. Food arrived. I've gone for a vegan burger. Looks nice, yeah? Oh. Look at this dude. He's huge. We are heading back. As you can see, it's now dark. There's a few lights along. We have got a torch. We just saw a big flash of lightning over there. I wonder if we're going to get a storm in the night. <laughs> I hope it doesn't start raining as well. Oh, it's really spooky. And we're like, we're on the proper path at the moment. I'm really not going to like going up to the campsite. We made it back onto the beach. Now we need to find our path. It's so dark. Time for our walk up to the tent. This is not going to be good. I don't think we're going to be doing this again in the dark, to be honest. Ooh. We're almost there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's some lights. There's lots of thunder going on. I hope Ooh. it holds off. Bless Ow. you. We're here. 
I love our little campsite. We've got some covers, although I really don't think we need them. I'm going to go and, whoa, big bug. We have electricity down there at the moment, so I'm going to go and plug the Mac in for a little bit. We're in the tent now. I've just been uh, sitting in like the little, I don't know what you call it, communal area. Uh, put it with my Mac on charge, because that's where like the sockets are and everything. And um, I was just chatting to this, I was just chatting to this guy. And uh, he's from, he's like, he knows one scare car hometown. He's from, he's from the Wirral. And um, he has like loads of family in Ormskirk and it's like, that's crazy. I'm on this little tiny island in Malaysia and there's someone who has family in the same little town as we are from. But anyway, <coughs> bless you. We are going to go to sleep. The rain has kind of started a little bit, but not nothing too bad. But we've all zipped up if it does come. Right, see you in the morning. Good night.